Good day everyone, this is Jake Rodriguez Pomperada from Bacolod City, Negros Occidental, Philippines. As we continue our C++ programming series, in this edition, we will learn how to write a program that will ask the user to give two numbers and then our program will find the quotient of two numbers. We will call our program division of two numbers using C++. Before we start, if you like this video tutorial, please click the like button, share, leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel for more upcoming video tutorials. So let's get started. We'll we are already here in our dev C++ programming environment. So the first step that we, that we will do is to de is to declare is to write the comment double slash for comment is division not cpp this is the file name of our program division of two numbers next i will write down my name as the author of this program jake rodriguez pomperada now basically the double slash in c++ it means that this symbol is used for comment no? commenting our code and then we have here the date uh, October 16, 2019 Wednesday 5.19am here in the Philippines next in uh, sharp include IO stream we declare this library file for input output using namespace std int main the int main is a function that is the starting point of our program execution so we declare a variable a b and then we have here the dev so console out new line to new line console out backslash t title of our program division of two numbers console out to new line now the two new line is for formatting new line this symbol represent the skip sequence in C++ so console out enter first number C in A And then we have here B for second number. Okay, so next we will use our Simon statement dev open parenthesis A slash B. We will divide console out new line to new line again. And then the quotient of a and b is we have here the dev ok so console out new line ok and ay, I forgot sorry backslash t and oh program that tells that the user that the program is already terminated so let us uh, review no, the things that we have done in this sample program so 
we declare a uh, comment here we use a library file and then we declare three variables having an integer here and then we have here the title of our program division of two numbers and then in this portion it will accept two numbers enter first number enter second number so the first number represent with a variable a the second input is represented by variable b and then we are using the assignment statement dev to compute to hold the value of a slash b we divide and then we display the result and then we have here end of the program that tells that the user that the program is already terminated so the next step that we'll do is to save our work press ctrl s from our keyboard and then we will create a folder here and then we will name the folder division of two numbers this is the title of our folder okay double click so we have here division that cpp division that cpp is the file name of our program click the save button and then we compile first to check for syntax error there is none so we will run our program okay so first number we have here 1000 second number let's say 10 so we are expecting to have 100 so the quotient of 1000 oh, okay there is a mistake Okay, <laughs> formatting problem. Okay, let us compile and run again. Take two. So we have here 1000, division of two numbers, the title of our program. Enter first number, I will give 1000. Enter second number, we will I will give 100. So we are expecting uh, 10, we are expecting 100. So we got it. The quotient of 1000 and 10 is 100. Okay, so we have already the right result, guys. So we will terminate the program and then we will run it again in the second time around. Let's say, for example, we have um, 200 division of two numbers. Enter first number, we have 200. And then enter the second number let's say for example we have 20 so the co the quotient of 220 is 10 and a program so we have already done and correctly execute our program to perform division of two numbers in C++ before we end if you like this video tutorial please click the like button share leave a comment in the comment section of this video tutorial and subscribe to my channel for more upcoming video tutorials thank you very much guys for watching i hope you have learned something new in this video tutorial actually every time that i make a video tutorial in this case in c++ uh, it it makes me happy along the way because I was able to share my knowledge in computer programming especially in C++ and I learned a lot also in writing a program in making, making mistakes testing and debugging so it is a very enjoyable experience for me as a as a person and as a software engineer so uh, until to the next video tutorial, this is Jake Rodriguez Pomperada from Bacolod City, Negros Occidental, Philippines. Bye bye for now.